Welcome back to the channel everybody. Uh, this is a quick unboxing of the uh, Entaphone Active Bluetooth Intercom Dual Pack. I bought this Intercom to go into these two next helmets. That's all. Let's see what we get in the box straight away. is as shipped as you can see it's the first time I'm seeing what arrives on the post okay we have wrapping around it so we have a box here I presume the two packs are inside and some lots of information and in various languages on the back there. And I presume what comes in the box at the bottom. So let's see. And then we we'll just push the sleeve out. And let's just put out here. There's a ah, it's a little sticky tape here um, and we shall see the protective foam there and there are the two units in there pop one out have a look a bit heavier than I thought it was going to look I thought it was going to be very very light it's a few kilograms, a few grams, but I think you wouldn't notice that if it was on the side of the helmet at all. So we've got a, those kind of dials on the front, we've got a USB type something, mini, mini USB at that end. Looks like exactly volumes up and down and various specific buttons on the side. That's one. And two, I presume they're identical. So yeah. So again, this is the uh, Intraphone Active Bluetooth Intercom. And it's the uh, twin pack that I've gone for. So let's see what's on underneath here. So it looks we've got three compartments. Let's take them one at a time. There's some microphones in here perhaps. A USB cable. Some Velcro and some Mic coverings, I presume. Wind buffering, wind protection. And some more Velcro round sticky bits, I presume, to pin things, pin things inside the helmet under the padding. So that's what's in that one. That side, the next compartment, oh, same compartment. Oh, same pack. Same again. Makes sense for the dual pack. I'm guessing in this other compartment. Yeah. Same again. Two of each. And this one is, I believe, a cradle that will be fixed at the side of the helmet. Yeah. So it's the cradle if it's the side of the helmet. And even that might actually come off because it looks like there's a bit of sticky on this side and a sort of a bracket mount on this side. So I presume there's two of those. Put back in there if I can get it back in there. Yeah, I'll do that later. All right, so the third compartment. Yeah, again, two packs of yeah microphone. So I'll put that one down here. 
open one. Let's see what we get. We have the microphone itself with a bit of Velcro stickies to pin inside the helmet. Is it bendy? Yeah, pretty bendy. And the earbuds, ear mics, the headphones. Again, with a bit of sticky on the back. I presume they'll be pinned into the right place. And their connectors. And actually, does this look like an even another mic as well? Could be two different mics. One's a button type. Yeah, I think it is. If you look at the ends here, these two mics are the same connector. So I'm guessing these are two different types of mics, how you want to use it. Air Force Pilot type or just a button type. And that's the headphones. So that's in that. So yeah, so the twin pack, you get two of each. Anything else in here? Some instructions for connectivity and wiring. Quick guide for those who want to read the, the long blurb. Seems pretty pretty good there with pictures and words. I like pictures. Read the words if I have to. Yeah, and in multiple languages. That's that one. And warranty terms. So, that's what we get in the Interphone Action Active Bluetooth Intercom. Two of these guys. Yeah. Looking forward to using them. I'll get them plumbed into the uh, two helmets here. So, just a quick one. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.